Um, thanks, Dr. Burke, for that introduction. Um, thank you for the Brain Foundation sponsors, donors, um, company members, and staff for awarding this research gift. I'm extremely grateful. I also um, accept this award on behalf of my co-investigator, Professor Meng Law, who couldn't be here today. Um, I'm a neurologist with subspecialty expertise in neuromuscular medicine, and I work at the Alfred Hospital. Um, it's interesting to mention stories and stories of the Brain Foundation. And uh, my story in neurology sort of began in stroke, in brain imaging and stroke. And it's sort of my formal training in neurology finished at the Mayo Clinic, um, actually working in neuromuscular diseases. Um, and it's here that I developed uh, a keen interest in deep phenotyping of nerve and muscle disorders. Um, and free phenotyping is essentially the story that nerves and muscles tell us. Um, this research project draws on my previous prior experience in imaging of brain blood flow in stroke and to utilize similar techniques to study the blood flow in nerves and muscles in disease. Um, nerve and muscle disorders are enjoying somewhat of a renaissance recently. Um, there have been an advent of new treatments for disorders that have uh, up until recently been considered untre untreatable. However, there remains uncertainty as to who should receive this treatment, when we should start this treatment, and more importantly, when we should stop treatment. It is our hope that by using novel imaging techniques to study the blood flow in proximal nerve segments, uh, we'll be able to develop a biomarker that will aid in the phenotyping and storytelling of complex nerve and muscle disorders. Um, this is relatively uncharted territory, um, in the field of nerve and muscle disorders at least, but has potential to significantly improve patient outcomes by early identification of nerve disorders and reduce morbidity by tailoring treatment strategies. I would like to once again thank the Brain Foundation uh, for providing me this opportunity and to share the story with the rest of Australia and the world. Thank you.